Hello YouTube, welcome back. Time for another check of the hive. This is day 13 of the hive and it is day seven since my last video where I dropped a comb. <gasps> so today, the goal of today's visit is to see how much more comb they've built to see if there are still bees in the hive and to see if I can re recover any of that comb and pull it out. So I've done a little modification to the hive you can see here. This is just a piece of white aluminum flashing. The sun rises over here in the east and sets over there and this is the west side of the hive and I noticed in the afternoons the sun is just pounding on the side of the hive so I put a little just a little aluminum flashing on the side here to create a little shade for afternoon sun so that's what that's what this is Wow they have eaten a lot of syrup this was about a gallon of syrup. There's probably maybe, uh, I don't know, an inch left in there from a week ago. Wind just picked up. All right, there's definitely more comb in here. So that is the comb that broke off last week, and I'm going to take that out today because it seems to be messing with the other comb they're working on. So that, that has to come out. And that bottom comb there is, that's got honey in it. And that has to come out as well. Oh, I made a mistake putting that back in there. All right, this was in the bottom of the hive. This is what fell off last week. And it looks like there's a lot of pollen. There's a little bit of honey maybe in there. Now there's a large piece of comb at the bottom here. This was my mistake, was putting that back in there. Beautiful comb on that frame. Three frames with beautiful comb, and then there's this mess at the bottom. Beautiful comb on this one. All right, I got the bad comb out. 
putting these guys back together. I'm gonna take the comb, let these guys go back to what they were doing. Everyone seems calm all of a sudden. I do need to come back with food. This is what came off the, the floor. It was, it was on the base of one of the frames, just hanging off the frame like that horizontally. All right, I'm gonna go inspect this and be back with some food. So this is the fallen comb that I dropped in the video called Beekeeper Fail. <gasps> when I dropped it, I initially picked it up from the ground and put it into the hive. I laid it across the, the bottom of the, uh, the frames that were not being used. And the bees have since uh, done a lot of work on this. When I dropped it, there was actually this this one here, when I dropped this, looked very similar to it, how it does now. Uh, it's just, there was sort of pollen in the center, and it was the same size. They haven't added to it. So. Pollen and honey, nectar, and we have some capped cells. These are bee cells. And you can see them in this one as well. Right here. So that makes me feel bad, but it's sort of beyond repair. I can't really hang this in a, fr I guess I could hang it in a frame, but oh no, little bee larva. This was in the very bottom of the hive going the wrong direction. And I guess I could go in and kind of try and wire it into a frame. It's pretty beat up though. And I'm not sure how viable this is. But I am open to suggestions. So these are the casualties. I, I'm sorry, I feel bad. But that was my mistake, and I feel bad about it. But I must say that this is, it feels like I'm learning by looking at this, and hopefully this makes me a better beekeeper in the future. And this is a learning experience. Feel free to comment below if you have any suggestions on what I should be doing with this. Thanks. I just got another gallon of food prepared, sugar water, and I'm gonna put the hive back together. All right, well, I opened the hive. They had uh, eaten about 80% of uh, the syrup that I left a week ago, uh, which was about a gallon of syrup. So that was good news. There uh, is more comb being built, and it looks really nice, really nice and straight, hanging very nicely inside on the frames. Some of the comb is touching all the way down to the bottom of the frames, which is great news for someone like me who has a habit of dropping comb 
the main goal today was to get the comb that I dropped and then threw back in the bottom of the hive to get that out of the hive. And it was laying across, the, the frames were hanging like this, and the comb was laying across the bottom of the frames, horizontally across three frames. So I was able to kind of pry the frames apart reach in and the comb wasn't attached to anything so it was pretty easy to just pull it right out. So that's the update. Uh, a much more positive experience this time. If you're enjoying this story please click the subscribe button. I would love to get subscribers. How do you say that? I, I don't know. If you see me doing anything wrong or stupid or positive or good, uh, please feel free to comment below or click the thumbs up button. Uh, I, I'm always open to uh, suggestions, criticism, comments, praise, you name it. Uh, I do like to have adult conversations about things, um, so keep that in mind. And uh, thanks so much for watching. This is, this, is, this is really exciting for me and it's really fun to learn about something brand new in my life. So stick around, click subscribe, let's be friends. Have an awesome day.